Good morning and happy weekend! TasteAtlas.com recently published a list of the best seafood in the world. And guess what? Pempe. Yes. Yes, it's number four on the list. Yeah. It's so I'm crazy, not surprised. Right? I'm not surprised. Yeah. Because Pempe is really good. It's, yeah. it's really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love Pempe. And it beats sushi out of all food. I think that's what's it, what's uh, interesting. Mm. Yeah. So uh, right now we have, of course, Michelle Wee. Yeah, thank you for having me back. Yes, in the uh, Yuk Masak segment. And right now, what are we going to do? We're going to make. Okay, so for today we're going to make shrimp gambas or can you pronounce it for me? It's uh, if I'm not wrong, uh -huh. it's gam gambas al ajillo. Oh, al ajillo. Al ajillo. Yes, it's so, a double L on the on the on the end. Yeah, uh, it's a Spanish food. Actually, it's an appetizer. Before it was an appetizer, but because it was really famous, now it's become an entree. An entree. An entree. Okay. Entree. Well, from what I know, it's a, it's a tapas. Yeah, it was a tapas. Yeah. So, yeah. but so, right now in the restaurant they serve it as a main course because it's really yeah. famous. Yeah. I because think it's also because it's, uh, it's prawns, you know, because yeah. we're not used to having that tapas culture where mm -hmm. you drink and then you, you, you eat food. Yeah. yeah Have you uh, ever tried to make it at home before? Yes. yes. So you can help me with this. Okay, so yeah, shall we start? I'll, I'll help you, yeah, let's shall go. Shall we start? Let's okay. First of all, in here I already have some shrimp. Yes. We can use medium size or big size of shrimp. Don't use the small one. And in here I already have slice of garlic. Mm -hmm. And this is optional. You can use some onion or shallots, but it's really optional. So can you heat up the olive oil for me? Okay, chef. Yes. Okay. You want a lot, right? A lot. Yeah. We have to use a lot yeah. because we're going to dip our baguette on the sauce yeah. later. It's supposed to be, the, the shrimps are supposed to be swimming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're going to heat up some oil and we're going to... Just add some garlic, onion, and that's it's really easy actually. It's actually very easy. Yeah. Spanish food is, I think it's just very easy. It's, um, there's not a lot to do mm -hmm. and not a lot of ingredients as well. Um, but it's, uh, what's important is the freshness of the, of the food that you're doing. Yeah. Have you ever awesome. been to Spain before? Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did, yeah. A, I did a backpacking trip mm -hmm. for two weeks me in too, me southern too. Spain. Oh, you've been as well? Yeah, I've been there. It's yeah, uh, and there's a lot of tapas over there, right? Yes, yes. I even kind of choose, tapas. yeah. It's full of tapas. Is it like around one or one and a half euro, if I'm not mistaken? Very cheap. Yeah, yeah very, very cheap. cheap. Very cheap. And in the south of Spain, from where I uh, where I went, uh, it was in every every part of uh, the Andalusian region, like uh, Valencia, mm -hmm. um, the every other uh, every other cities uh -huh. uh, what you get is so you pay for drinks and then you get and then pizza you get food. Pass. yeah oh you get yeah, pizza yeah, pass. yeah yeah, yeah not, true, true, usually true, true, true. it's uh you you buy food and then you mm. get drinks right mm. now it's the other way around yeah yeah so now uh-huh what do we do we're gonna wait it's until yeah it's heating up and here i already have some chopped fresh parsley mm -hmm. don't use dry parsley otherwise it's not gonna be fragments and stuff yeah. yeah yeah okay it's heating up right now yeah, it's one thing i hate the most is dried um herbs ah oh. yeah oh okay can you stir up the garlic for me oh, and in right. here i already have some shrimp and we're gonna put some salt you want the onion go as well yep please and here i have some smoked paprika Yes, that's really um, something um, Andalusian, smoked paprika or Spanish. Andalusian. Yeah. Oh. You like to travel a lot? I do. I do, yeah, yes. It's yeah. one of the things in life that I enjoy the most, traveling. Because then you get to, 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 to uh, experience a lot of food, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. True, 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 yeah. true. Eat a lot of food, you get to meet uh, different people. Can you put a bit of salt? Yes. Salt. In the oil? No, to the shrimp. Okay. Because we're going to mix it first. Make sure the shrimp is dry before you... Okay, enough. Be before you put season on it. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to add the shrimp. It's going to be quick because we don't want to overdo it. Yeah. 
Yeah. Because that one thing uh, about cooking shrimp is that you always want to keep it not overcooked. Yep. So true, that true, it true, stays true. crunchy. Uh, I think we have to make the... up the game. Yep. Um, yes, and the uh, osmo paprika goes here. And now, after a while, we're gonna add some red dried chili. Yes. Yeah. This needs to be dried. Yeah. 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 Because if you use the fresh, fresh. one, it's not gonna work. It will be udang balado. Udang balado, <laughs> true, true. It's not gonna be Spanish food. Okay, I think we can flip it up. Yeah. We just want to reach this color. Yeah, just coloring. Mm -hmm. Can you flip the rest for me? Sure thing. And then I'm gonna add some dried red chili. And in here, I also have dried paprika. Not, paprika. not the smoked one, but the dried paprika. Yeah. I just want to add for the color. I think that's uh, for for most home cooks, uh, paprika is something often get confused because mm -hmm. uh, at least here in Indonesia, paprika is uh, the bell pepper. Yep, right? bell pepper. Right? Because mm -hmm. uh, when you go to like Spain or other countries in Europe, it's paprika is the the dried um, pepper. Oh really? Yep. Oh, okay, that, chef. <laughs> that's what you call uh, paprika. <laughs> Okay, now. So now, I can, lemon. We can turn the heat off. Yeah. This is enough. It's enough. I'm gonna add some parsley. Mmm, nice. I always love this uh, this color, you know. Yeah. This green. And then there's a uh, squeeze yellow. of lemon juice mm -hmm. to add freshness. I think we can move it to the. Can you help me with this? Sure. Because in here I already have some baguette. It's optional. You can toast it first, or you can just dip it into the oil. You want me to plate? Yep. Maybe do it here. If you need this one. So simple. Yes, it is. So the oil yep. needs to be there, like. Present. Can you pass me a spoon? Uh, or oh, a... this one. Thank you. So all the flavors are in the oil, and we want it to be. Now it's like a. I don't know. I'm supposed to be the one who's helping you. Yeah, <laughs> but are you not, helping me I'm, now? I'm explaining the dish. <laughs> so it's supposed to be. Um, yeah, it's supposed to be you. <laughs> so, okay. Okay, there you go. over here. Okay. And then we can add the baguette on the side. Yes. This is what I love the most about any food from European from Europe is that you get to dip the bread in that saucy nice goodness. Yes. Okay. I love the portion size as well. It's a uh, perfect for tapas. Yes, yeah. that's it. It's really easy and I think you can make it at home. It's less than 15 minutes, right? Yes, we Really, really easy. We yeah. just did it. You can see. All right. Yeah. And so, uh, shall we try? Yes. I am very excited. Just... Oh yeah. I'll do it from here. Mmm. 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 It's not overcooked. It's perfect. I love the donuts. Yeah. Donuts is good. Mm. Shall we dip the? Yes. Baguette? Let's do it. If you have like, if you don't have baguette at home, you just can use any bread. Roti tawar. Roti tawar. Sourdough would be good. Sourdough, well. yeah. Yep. Mmm. Mm. Feeling like I'm in Spain. Mm. Mm. It's uh, salty, um, fragrant, very, because of the olive very oil. Very fresh. It's very mm -hmm. fresh because of the parsley and the lemon. Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, but also very umami, very very umami, yeah, very, sure, umami, sure, very sure. gooey. Yeah. But we didn't put any MSG. Yeah, right. It's just from the. We don't put any sugar bond. as well. It's only from the salt and the yeah. paprika. 
this is. Oh, you like that much? No, I love it. Man, oh. I haven't had breakfast. So, this is my breakfast. Oh, Thanks for making it. it. Happy to hear it. Mm. Mm. Okay. Mm. So good. Can you pass me that? Mm. Tissue? Tissue, thank yeah. you. Mm. Okay. All right, so shall we? Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you for Is having okay? me. Mm -hmm. Yes, my pleasure. Mm. It's my pleasure. So now let's take a break. But when we come back, we'll have more updates from around the world when we return. So stay with us.